Appalachian Wireless is Appalachian Advantage. Unlimited text, talk, and two gigs of data for as low as $45 a month. Or if you like, get five lines on eight gigs of data for just $145 a month. See store for details. Better service, bigger savings. That's today's Appalachian Wireless and East Kentucky Network Company. Here's the President's message. The war on coal is over. The Environmental Protection Agency made a stop in Hazard this morning to formally announce the decision to rescind the Obama administration's clean power plan. EPA Administrator Scott Pruitt and Senate Majority Leader Mitch McConnell made the announcement at Wayne Supply Company to a standing room only crowd. This lets us know that it's actually more than just a feeling of hope, that there actually is going to be legislative process that's going to be signed tomorrow. That's the beginning of more that's going to be coming through that lets our industry catch its breath and actually creates a market for us that pretty much was afraid to use coal because they were going to be penalized by the federal government. The Clean Power Plan was an effort to curb carbon dioxide emissions at power plants by 32 percent from 2005 levels. The goal was to be met by reducing emissions from coal burning plants as well as other efforts. Regional coal producers were surprised by Secretary Pruitt's visit, but say the appearance gives them hope. What we had under the Obama administration with the Clean Power Plan, it was devastating for the coal industry. So with this repeal or with this withdrawal, I think it gives us opportunity uh, to protect uh, the coal fleet and hopefully uh, have an opportunity to build new coal fire power plants. President Donald Trump called the Clean Power Plan a job-killing regulation. Secretary Scott says that scrapping the plan means the end of what he called the war on coal. In Hazard, Shelby Porter, EKB News.